Come in. Hello, Alex. How are you doing today? Hey, Alex, good to see you. Great. Great to see you as well. Mind if I sit down? Yeah, please. Great. Thank you. So, how are you doing today? <sighs> Not too bad. You know, business is humming along. Great. Great. Uh, well, I, I would like to start off the meeting by asking you if you'd like to include anybody else. I know last time we talked about uh, including a decision maker here. Is is Miss Wilson available? Or? No, no, we're good all by ourselves. Okay, great, great. Well, well, basically, what I'd like to start off by is summarizing our last meeting, mm -hmm. telling you exactly what what I've come up with for possible solutions mm -hmm. uh, that are customized to your business, and then uh, we can move from there on on prices and and whatnot. So, terrific. is that all right with you? That's terrific. Great. Well, basically, from our last meeting, uh, we spoke about uh, the time that it takes to not only collect, but calculate and call in those payroll hours. Mm -hmm. uh, that was more on, on Patty's end. Um, but also the errors on the employee um, time cards that has an effect on the checks that they receive, their morale we talked about, that you want to make sure that, that they are very, very customer-oriented when they're doing their job mm -hmm. in the face of the customer, obviously, which helps you grow. Uh, then we talked about HR and pre-employment services, as well as tax and compliance. Uh, now, has anything changed from our last meeting that you'd like to tell me about today uh, so I have a better understanding? Yeah, you know, I mean, I think just, um, you know, continued aggravation uh, with some things going on in terms of um, keeping up with, uh, you know, some of the stuff you're talking about, getting the information appropriately to my accountants uh, to keep me from getting billed a little bit extra from them. Okay. Uh, you know, that's, uh, that's something I'm always concerned about, you know, when Patty makes these mistakes that you're talking about, um, you know, that causes double work for my accountants, which causes them to double bill me. And um, certainly I don't like that. Right. Double billing is no good. Now, now, is that the only thing that has changed from the past meeting that you'd like to talk about? Otherwise, we're in pretty much the same position. Okay, great. Now, when you tell me about your accountants and, and those double billings, can you tell me about a time that that recently happened or, or anything that sticks out in your mind? Sure. Well, you know, uh, there's that new hire uh, tax credit going on right now mm -hmm. where uh, if you hire people, um, you know, within a certain, uh, and get the paperwork in within a certain time frame, uh, you know, the, the government decided to give you a tax credit for that against some of the taxes you have to pay as a payroll tax. Exactly. Uh, Patty has missed some, some deadlines as far as that goes and, and cost ourselves the credit, so that's just another uh, kind of more recent uh, piece of that. Okay, so that could uh, contribute to another profit leakage. And I know uh, from, from what we last were talking about, uh, you might be looking to expand in the future. Now, can you tell me a little bit about how uh, Patty missing those deadlines and you not increasing your cash flow, how that's going to affect your future aspirations of the company? Well, certainly, um, you know, it's no secret anybody can turn on the news right now and tell you the credit is tight with banks and so on and so forth. So when things like that happen, you know, every dollar kind of counts in terms of what I can present to the banks exactly. to go and get increased credit lines to go and open my next location and so forth. Exactly. So that's, that's one more reason why uh, ADP has a solution for you. Uh, we take care of that. Or uh, if we do um, go move forward with our HR pre-employment services, we would take care of that for you. So you would also be getting that benefit of, of submitting it on time instead of uh, late past the deadline. Mm -hmm. uh, so is there anything else that you'd like to talk about today before I get into uh, basically presenting the prices and, and the packages for you? Well, I, mean, I guess and you're going to talk, talk about it. I mean, you know, right now, I just uh, again, we talked about this last time and it kind of ties together you know I do want to simplify some things I can see where I can kind of streamline some things right. at the same time I don't want to get overly complicated I don't know that I want to start uh, you know spending all sorts of dollars on upgrading my technology to accommodate uh, you know bringing in a service such as yours okay okay and, and one thing uh, now so so basically what you're trying to tell me there is uh, you'd like to simplify and you'd like to streamline but you're a little worried about that first step into technology and, and how that's going to affect your business. Is that correct? Well, it's not so much the step into technology, it's so much as the cost of oh, the step okay. into technology. Oh, okay. More cost. Right. Yeah, and, and as I explained last time, I mean, uh, cost, I, I have uh, essential prices here for, for our different bundles. And, and like I told you, we, we do offer discounts on that. But um, also going back to what we talked about before is the return on investment. And, and, and by simplifying and streamlining your operations, you're going to receive a lot more of your cash flows coming in, uh, which is going to, I mean, it's going to benefit your overall operations. Does that sound all right to you? Well, it certainly sounds reasonable. Great. Exactly. Uh, so if you don't mind, I'd like to start getting into the presentation here. Great. Um, as I talked about earlier, I mean, this is the, the overview uh, of what we're using here. It uh, gives you the complete 360 of your business uh, from hire to fire with your employees, including the payroll 
and HR that we talked about recently. So I'll keep that with you. Um, now another thing that we have here uh, is our pricing models on, on our different bundles that I put together. Uh, so that, I mean, I'd like to explain a little bit more in depth on this. Uh, okay. Our essential bundle is going to include the basic payroll operations. Uh, so this is going to take time from from Patty, it's going to streamline there uh, and, and increase your cash flow by making sure you're not having profit leaks that come with errors and, and underpaying employees as well as overpaying employees. But we're also going to deal with your um, tax depositing, uh, filing those reports for you, and then all the, the pre-employment services that we talked about recently. Now, do you see how, how an essential service like that, uh, just those benefits that I'm telling you about, could benefit your business? Well, it certainly seems going right down the path that we're talking about. Okay, exactly. Now, one step further into that, and, and this, is, this is how I compiled it, is I basically looked at three different bundles for you. One is our essential, one is our enhanced, and one is our complete. Um, the next step of the process is going to go into the enhanced bundle. Uh, this is going to include all of the um, payroll options and everything that we talked about, but it's also going to go into a little bit more about the signing checks for you, um, making sure that's taken care of. Uh, then uh, having a human resource team and help desk available uh, in order to stay with the labor law and compliances. Uh, now, does that sound like something that you'd be interested in? Everything sounds interesting until you start telling me how much it costs. Exactly, right? exactly. And we're going to get into and that. And then also how that would actually, you know, function. I mean, certainly that sounds in theory good, but again, from a from perspective of, you know, simplifying, yet at the same time straddling the line to not overcomplicate. Exactly. You know, I'd like to see more about, you know, how exactly that would happen. And just to tackle that complication right away, I mean, uh, I, I already told you that I'm here for you. I'm your personal rep. We also have representatives supporting myself. Mm -hmm. uh, you have my cell phone number already, so if any, any way down the line you have any questions about anything, you have a couple different layers of, of different people you can talk to to help you feel a little more mm -hmm. comfortable. Yeah. Hey, Patty. Hi. Hello. Hi. Miss Wilson, Kyle Hageman, sales rep at ADP. How are you doing? Nice to meet you. Good. Alex, really? Don't you remember five years ago? The problems we've had with ADP? I'm just talking. What are you thinking, Alex? What are you thinking? I'm just trying to keep an open mind, just talking. Would you mind sitting down with us and having a conversation? I can tell you a little bit about what the things that ADP has changed to uh, enhance those services that, that you might be talking about. Kyle, it was real nice meeting you, but i got to go do payroll. Well, actually, we'd, we'd like to sit down and talk to you about payroll as well, if you, if you have the time. I mean, I just need maybe 10 minutes of your time. I don't have the time. I'm sorry. Okay. Thanks, Patty. Told you last time, mean as a snake. Hey, that's, that's something that I'd like to help you with by uh, relieving some of that stress of the time that she's worried about. Um, but I'd like to get a little bit deeper into the enhanced um, because that's the, the function that we were on here. Mm -hmm. um, so not only are we going to take care of the essential services, mm -hmm. um, but also go into the check delivery, the human resource team, and the, the labor law and compliance. Uh, mm -hmm. So you're also, I know we talked about last time a little bit about the tax fever that comes around, um, really helping you out with that so you don't have that turn in stomach when that comes. Right. Now, uh, does that sound like a benefit to you? I know. Well, uh, and I'll stop right there. And, yes. you know, joke aside about mean as a snake, you know, her point is not necessarily invalid. I mean, we've had you guys here before. You certainly seem like a, a nice guy, mm -hmm. but I also realize you're not going to be the guy I'm dealing with day to day. You're not going to be the guy who's going who's gonna, to, you know, service this payroll if we were to go this route. I mean, what makes me think it's going to be any better now than it was before? Well, I'm glad you said that because our president and CEO once said that sh such shortcomings should be viewed as an opportunity to le learn refocus our values, and live up to our efforts. So that's something that I take personal pride in, is that ADP is um, always innovating. Uh, they've done a complete 180 on customer service. Uh, so like you said, uh, if, you're, if you're concerned about not being able to contact me, uh, that I'm going to leave you with services, and then you won't be able to get any of our representatives, that, that is no longer an issue, and I can promise you that. OK, that so how does that, well, how does that ha work? How does that work? Uh, well, basically, what we're going to do is, is, if you do choose to go with services today, uh, we're going to have myself here for your first payroll to ensure everything goes smoothly. Like I said, you already have my contact information, but we're also going to have a dedicated specialist there for your first two times of the payroll. Mm -hmm. uh, this is another step in the process that we'd like to walk you through and ensure that this is a smooth transition for you. 
and and I understand the business, and I understand uh, uh, a time where where there's been some previous uh, shortcomings that you, that you want to avoid that. But really, what I'd like to do today is is develop or tell you about the the different things under the bridge that might keep you from moving on and and succeeding as a company. And I want to build that bridge to success, so you don't have to worry about those. Does that kind of help some of alleviate some of those concerns? Yeah, you can keep going. Okay, thank you. Uh, so then our complete solution is basically combining both the essential and the enhanced, and then doing the, the general ledger interface, as well as the background checks and the employee handbook wizard. So this is going to go a little bit deeper into the HR services that we talked about, a lot of time that you were spending sifting through resumes, interviewing and training employees, and then finding out later that they weren't the best fit for your company. Mm -hmm. Now, does that sound like, like maybe the overall best um, solution for your company? Um, you know, it certainly sounds like a lot of a lot of good stuff. Again, we're, you haven't shown me what it costs yet. Exactly. So. Now, now I'd like to transition into the pricing. Mm -hmm. um, so basically, for our setup costs, it's going to be two hundred dollars. Mm -hmm. uh, that's going to be a one-time fee to set everything up for you. Um, but besides that, we're looking at about a fifty-dollar base cost, and then two twenty-five per check. And what I'm explaining right now is our complete solution, mm -hmm. because I want to give you everything you need to succeed, mm -hmm. and I'm going to tell you how to do that. Um, and then we're times in that by 300 employees, so you're looking at about 725 per week for that. Now, does that sound like a, a price that that you're able to allocate currently, or? Which, uh, that sounds like a bit much. It sounds like a bit much. And what, what do you? I mean, you're charging me to set me up. Well, the the setup fee is basically us coming in with a dedicated implementation or implementation specialist. Uh, they're going to take care of all the setup and, and ensure that everybody's trained and knowledgeable on our services, uh, so that you don't have those uh, future problems of someone not not being equipped with the right knowledge there. Mm -hmm. So, so that's the initial. So that's, setup. that's that's the, that's the and this is for the complete, right? This is the. This is the complete, this correct? Is, this is this is this is the you're showing me the high end first. I, I mean, high end has the the most solutions geared towards your business, and this is the one that I this is my main bundle for you. Uh -huh. uh, but understanding your cash flow, I mean, and the Portobello restaurant as a whole, I put together two other solutions mm -hmm. for you as well. Okay. So I mean, is this still of interest to you, or? Um, well, I'd like to see what some of the other things cost. I mean, you know, again, money I take away from this means I got to buy a cheaper tomato sauce or what have you, and then exactly. suddenly my food isn't as good, and suddenly those people are coming here. And and then I'm not expanding. So. Exactly. And what I'd like to tell you, too, is, is a lot of the things that we were talking about before, uh, freeing up Patty's time, three hours of her time per week, that equals about 144 hours a year. I'm not sure if Patty gets paid hourly or salary. That's a lot of money that you're saving there. If she is being set, paid salary, she has that time to free up for other areas of your business, mm -hmm. which could also improve profits. The errors, we talked about overpaying your employees, uh, the ramifications with that, but also under underpaying uh, your employees. Uh, so what are what the effects are of something like that if your cook walks out on a Friday night before, before the hot time comes. Um, then your HR sifting through resumes. I mean, we're cutting down, and, and we're really cutting down your operations where you're, you're only going to be doing what you need to to proceed in your operations. So we're kind of cutting off that unnecessary time and, and money. Okay, well what are some of the other options? Okay, well our essential costs are right here. Uh, again, it's $200 for the setup, but this brings it down to $30. Um, and then the 150 per check is gonna be around $480. Mm -hmm. Now this is about half the price, but again, you're gonna be losing a few of the services that we felt beneficial before. Mm -hmm. And um, if, if you don't mind, I'd like to, to go back to the complete solution just because um, I, re I really wanna tell you a little bit more about that pricing and how, how it can be beneficial for your company. Mm -hmm. uh, so one thing that we did talk about is the tax and compliance. Right now, uh, you said that with paychecks, there's been an instance before, at the end of the year, you having to come up with a large sum of money to, to pay those taxes because your reports weren't accurate. Now, that wasn't only, um, not only was that effect on your cash flow, but also you running around trying to get this extra money in a, in a slower month than usual. Um, and the insurance that we were talking about, the unemployment, and uh, if anything were to happen, uh, workman's compensation. I mean, there's a lot of value in that uh, price for the complete solution. Mm -hmm. Does that kind of help you a little bit out with the price? Well, I mean, it, it, it's moving there. And what's the middle one look like? Middle one is enhanced. Uh, that's going to be $200 for setup. It equals about $640. Um, you are losing uh, about a little bit on the HR services, but the $640 is, is very well spent for different services that we felt beneficial in our last meeting. Now, now, if you don't mind, what I'd like to do is move forward with this and set up a time about two to three weeks 
uh, where we can implement this and get going so you can start stop you can stop your profit liquid leakage and start going to where you want to be well, I think the probably the enhanced version probably is what makes the most sense for me from a cost perspective it's, okay. uh, it allows me to uh, you know keep a little money and I don't even know if I need all the HR pieces from the complete service.